here bringing you guys a brand new video on exile rsps um first time on this server so we're going to show you guys the whole entire server uh give you a little tour on the whole entire server and what it looks like and all the customs that they have and everything like that so starting off we have this exiles guide tour that we're going to talk to welcome to exiles before we get started have you played exiles before uh show me the tutorial I'll show you around. Let's get started. This is the Slayer Master area. Okay. So this is like their Slayer Masters. They have Tyrael, Maskna, Duradel, Cristelia, and Naive. Uh, it's probably like the more boss and duo. Um, and then they have a Wilderness Slayer as well. Um, over here is more of their shops, like the rain shops, melee shops. Okay, let's move on. And then they have another area over here where their extra shops. Um, which you can get, you know, different um, aspects to your game, which are skill scapes and daily tasks. Um, this is the hub containing the prayer altar with spellbook swap, rejuvenation pool, and teleport sleeping stalls, and smoothie can be found east of the bank. Okay, that's really cool. That's the basic. Be sure to check out the guide section of your quest tab if you want more information, which is your pickle tab, which is probably this tab right here. Uh, Oh wow, that's really cool. Holy cow, that's awesome. I really like that. They even have a collection lock. Okay, you can now select your game mode. Be sure to check out the starter NPCs around this area, then talk to Merlin to be sent to the main plan. Okay, so we got normal, we got legend, Iron Man, duo Iron Man, legend Iron Man. Yo, what? This is crazy. Hardcore Iron Man, ultimate Iron Man. I think we're gonna go ahead and do what is legend? So it's a lot less XP than normal, but it seems like you get 10% bonus drop rate. So maybe we'll just go with, you know, I don't know. That's 10% drop rate. I'm sure is like really, really good on this server. So let's go with Legend. Let's make our Legend character. You have chosen to play in Legend mode. I wish you the best of luck on your grind. Good luck on your adventure. Yo, what's going on, guys? It's your boy Perplexy here, bringing you guys a brand new video on Exiles. Um, absolutely insane server, but before we get into this video, we are going to be doing a giveaway. We're going to be giving away three $10 bonds, that's right, three, uh, to one lucky winner. All you have to do is comment your in-game name below, make sure you guys are subbed to the channel, and make sure you guys like the video. Um, best of luck to all you guys, and I hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so starting off, when you come to the home area, if you come to the left over here, you will see this exile portal. All you have to do is click enter, and you will have all your teleports here. Uh, these are all the safe zones. Um, I think most of them are safe zones. The player killing are more of the wildy zones, so be prepared to be able to be killed in the wildy zones, which revenants are usually like the best to get a lot of loot usually, uh, but you always can get killed. But so these are all the teleports that you can teleport to. So you got the monsters, you got the dungeons, you got the bosses, mini games, skilling, and then player killing. So for the monsters, they have so many, like so many, like elf warriors, hill giants, lizards, rock crabs ambient crabs for dungeons i think these are like all more of your like slayer dungeons kind of things uh yeah like the catacombs of Karand, um kill fight lair uh, you know relica dungeon slayer tower uh smoke dungeon stronghold cave so these are more of like your dungeons for like slayer so if you guys want to do slayer definitely use the dungeons and then for the bosses they have a shit ton of bosses wow this is crazy there's so many like what they have the monogrillas crazy archaeologists that's you know wilder these are wilderness areas so when it says wild right here it's kind of the wilderness so you want to make sure you're safe enough um to be able to get out of there if you have to they have callistial alchemical hydra abyssal sire cerberus chaos fanatic chaos elemental corporal beast i kind of want to check some of these out let's go ahead and check out the lizard shaman this looks really really cool Yo, like, look at this. They literally have, like, lizard shamans. What? That's so crazy. Another thing that I absolutely love about this server is it is through Runelite, which is, you know, OSRS. Um, Runelite is one of the best uh, sources slash clients to use, and I absolutely love it. So, it, it, it give you, like, a rundown of, like, everything. So, all you do to see the drops is you just, Oh, we just died. All you do to see drops is click examine, and it'll show you all their drops that you can get from the monster viewer uh, table. 
Uh, moving on, let's see what else they have for bosses. They also have Alchemica Hydra. I do want to see this one too. Let's go ahead and enter the Alchemical door. Oh, you need a Slayer level of 95 to fight this Chemical Hydra. Okay. Well, we don't have that, so we can't do that. They also have Dagonoth Kings, Demonic Rillas, God Wars, King Black Dragons, Kraken, Lizard Shamans, Scorpia, Thermonuclear, Smoke Devils, Venetinis, Fedion, Vorkath, Zolra. I mean, they have so many bosses. And then moving on for the mini games, they have Barrows, Chambers of Azirak, Dual Arena, Fight Caves, Inferno. I love Inferno. Lightho Lighthouse for the God Books, a Lizard Man Assault, Mage Arena, Mutant Tarn. Pest Control, Recipe for Disaster, Theater of Blood, I love Theater of Blood too, and then they have Warriors Guild, and then moving on for like the skilling, if you guys want to do like skilling and stuff, they have all sorts of skilling here. So if you guys ever need to like get to anywhere, all you gotta do is come to the left of the home area and click this little portal right here, Exile Portal, it's a little red portal, and you can get to any um, zone that you need to. Also, if you want to go to like your last zone like I do right here, um, it'll teleport you to your last zone where you are currently at. Yo, what is this? It just says Vespula has spawned. Hunt? Wait, hold on. I gotta check this out. No monster is currently being hunted. So I'm guessing they have like global bosses that can be hunted and you can get like certain loot for them. That's really cool. I've never seen that. So Vespula. I gotta make sure to look out for that. That's really cool though. So they like they have global bosses too. Um, that's really neat. That's a cool thing to see. Over here to the right of the exile portal, we have a slayer portal as well as like a reaper task portal. Um, and then if you want to go to your Slayer Masters, all you do is click this little uh, portal right here next to it and it'll send you all the way to the Slayer Masters which are over to the left um, of the home area. So we're going to go ahead and check the Reaper task coming soon. Oh, they don't have it out yet. Um, so if you just want to get a Slayer task, all you have to do is grab a Slayer task by the Slayer task and then you can come here and go to your Slayer task which is really, really nice because usually you just have to teleport yourself to your Slayer task but I'm sure you can just teleport through this way as well. They also have banks over here. They have a rejuvenation, restoration pool. Um, you have you can only do it like every 120 seconds. Uh, so if you just want to go to full health again, they also have an altar right here. You can switch your spell books as well. Um, but yeah, it's kind of the home area. It's really cool. It's really nice looking. I actually love it. It's Edgeville, of course. Edgeville is one of the best looking homes to me, in my opinion. Moving on over here, we have a magic shop, a range shop, a melee shop, a consumables shop uh, to buy all your like consumables and pots and food. Um, they have the general shop where you can just sh sell all your shit as well as buy certain skilling gear. Uh, they have an Iron Man store. I can't ask that, access that, I don't think. Yeah, you must be an Iron Man to access that. Okay, that's really cool. Moving on over here, we have the Donate to Goodwill. Bonus experience for 1.5 times experience is 100k or 25 mil. Okay. Drop rate increase times 1.2%, 500k or 50 mil. Uh... And recent donators, you can see who donated recently. Oh, that's really cool. So you can get like more XP if you donate a lot more money to the well. Um, moving on over here, we have the Luke the Voter. If you click rewards, you can see the vote shops here. They have mystery boxes, super mystery boxes, ultra mystery boxes, and then a bunch of other rewards. These are really, really cool. Like they have a I don't even I don't even want to butcher that they have some sort of key that you can get for voting it's literally two vote points so if you guys want to vote make sure you guys vote it's probably one of the number one things to do on the server so all you guys got to do is do colon colon vote or you can also just hit vote right here on the Luke the voter uh, moving on they do have wise old man for skill scapes uh, Mac level 126 I'm sure this is for like prestiging or whatever um, they have Zahuro uh, which can make like your unfinished potions and stuff and for herb lore and stuff like that. They have Watson over here um, for clue scrolls. Here's like your daily tasks. So if you want to do like a daily task, you can get rewards like bonus XP book 35% for 30 minutes. Wow. And 15. So daily tasks are probably definitely, definitely worth doing. All you have to do is click this little interface right here, do open interface, and you have to complete five Slayer tasks. And you will get a supply crate in 100k. You complete three, you get a mystery box in 200k. So that's definitely worth doing daily tasks. They have a mode wizard. You can't change your mode while wearing items. So if you guys ever want to change your mode to a different mode, you can do that by this mode wizard right over here. Over here we have Odo God Blast. Use a Zamorakian Spear Enemy to turn it into a Hosta. <laughs> Yo, look how many Slayer Masters they have. They have so many. 
They have so many. You got Steve, you can get a Kraken task from this guy. What? Oh, over here, down here. That's really cool. I've never seen that. They have Turtle, Maskana, Duradel, Crystelia. I've never seen this person, Crystelia. That's that's new. And then they have Naive. You can get boss assignments. You can get duo assignments. I don't have a duo Slayer partner, so I can't get one. But they do have duo assignments, which is really, really nice. And then they have the rewards. You can do Slayer points rewards, duo Slayer rewards, and Slayer coin shop. Slayer coin shop is just like, you know, the shop for like your tasks you're going to need to buy things for. Um, and then you talk to her again. You can either get a boss assignment, get a duo assignment, or how does Slayer work? Show me the rewards, and we're going to do Slayer points rewards. So these are all the awards you can get. You can get a Dark Light, Salve Amulets, Rings, Imbued Scrolls, Royal Sea Pod, Gem Bags, Herb Sacks. I mean, you can get so many things. And then you can unlock a bunch of things as well with your points, like Slayer Experience, um, Clue Scroll Chance Increases, Auto Caskets so that automatically pick up all Slayer Caskets. And then you can like block your tasks, extend your tasks, get tasks, whatever you want to do. And then the masters, which will show you what levels that you need, um, like Reaper. Oh, you can see their tasks and stuff. That's so crazy. I've never seen that. They have so many features I've never ever seen. Like that's insane. Like their Slayer on this is so huge. I love Slayer on servers, so that's a huge. So if you guys come into the middle of the home area, you will see this guy named Benny. Uh, so this is the donation manager you can see the benefits promotions and you can also donate if you click donate It'll bring you to another page and you can donate that way as well as just do colon colon donate in game But here's all the benefits you got sapphire emerald ruby dragonstone onyx Zenite, and then there's new ranks that are coming as well uh, They do have promotions as well 5,000 points for a free $5 bond So they have promotions that you guys can get as well as mystery boxes full void set if you get uh, 3,000 points then they have a shop where you can just buy your stuff with your points as well as like super rares which you can get like a santa set which is really really cool and then they have miscellaneous things like a top hat and mancanalus a rune cane a dice up to 100 and then you can buy credits as well which will pop up another um website as well when you guys start out make sure you come to this referral master right here and you click talk to the referral master Hello, Perfect Sam. May I ask how you heard of us? You will be rewarded for your time. All you guys have to do is enter a referral name and then put my name, Perplexy. And I already did it, but you will get a mystery box and you can literally get super good things. I literally got a Abyssal Whip out of it. So make sure you guys, when you start, you come to this referral master and type in my name, Perplexy. And you guys will be rewarded with a mystery box and a 100k or something like a mil. I think it's a mil. Uh, I'm not exactly sure, but I think it is a mil. I'm not sure. Over here we have the Grand Exchange, which is also like a POS where you can see recent items that were listed that you can buy and sell as well as your own. Um, moving on down below over here we have the Magical Chest. So like if you guys do raids or whatever and you lose your items, you come over here and you can claim them again and get them back. If you guys ever want to do like Barrels for Barrels gloves, just click this portal for the boss and you can get the gloves over here and buy your own Barrel gloves as well. Uh, the Collector... I've never seen this. Adventure, have you heard about the book that keeps track of everything you've collected? It's marvelous. Fuck yeah, I want one. Actually, here I have a spare one. Anyways, you can also access the log by going to the quest tab, which is the purple tab, and then going to the collection log right here and opening the collection log. That's so cool. They have an absolute... They, dude, they literally have everything for a collection log. They have, like, raids too. What? That's crazy. And clue scrolls. You can see we can get out of master clues and stuff. Wow. That's crazy. Holy cow. That is so cool. And then they have others like revenants and pets and stuff like that. And ultra out of the ultra mystery boxes. <laughs> That's so cool. Like we got the missile whip out of the mystery box. One out of 32. That's crazy. That's insane. And then they have the drop tables. So when you come click this little quest tab right here, and this will be like the information on all the players online. Um, also with your slayer task and your duo slayer task, as well as your daily as well. Um, and then the red little portal thing will be like more of like PvP stats and like you just your slayer points and everything like that And then the green portal will be like your achievements diary So if you guys want to do like achievements and stuff all you have to do is click these things and then it'll tell you what you need to do to get achievements um, And then the purple little icon is like your drop tables drop simulator daily task manager achievements um, combat achievements titles collection log chest box rewards you can see all the chests that you can get out of different wards like they have third age boxes rare boxes winner's chest like they have so many things on this server like this is freaking crazy 
holy cow they have a money guide if you guys ever want to see how to make money on here boss lane guide slayer guide skilling guide they just have so many things on this server you guys if you guys are definitely looking for ser server definitely check out exile it is absolutely insane before we end this video you guys we are going to be doing a giveaway like i said earlier in the video we are going to be giving away three ten dollar bonds all you guys have to do is comment your in-game name below. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel and make sure you guys like the video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and definitely check out Exile. Absolutely insane server. Everybody get your fucking hands up.